welcome back to my channel. So today for What You Make in Monday, I'm going to be making meatloaf in a muffin tin. So I've made meatloaf many times before. My mom has an awesome recipe, but it's made in like a loaf pan and I just can never get it to cook through all the way. So I was going to try and see if I could make a meatloaf using these little muffin tins here. Maybe it'll get my kids to eat them more. I'm not sure, but I'm willing to give this new recipe a try. So I'm gonna do the meatloaf, I'm gonna do some mashed potatoes, and then I'm going to make some green beans in the oven. <laughs> that's what we're calling it, um, cooked for 25 minutes and then I let it rest for five minutes. So that gave me time to get the potatoes done. And I did make some green beans in the oven. You could do asparagus, pretty much any vegetable you want. Um, it does have ketchup in the meatloaf and ketchup on top, but you can always have a little extra because I like to have a little extra on my meatloaf. tastes really good. So I guess the true test will be my children. <laughs> I really like meatloaf. I think my husband likes meatloaf. So we'll see if maybe the smaller portions will be a little more appealing to them. But it cooked perfectly, which like I said at the beginning, I struggled with when I make a big meatloaf. So this might be my go-to method if my children like it, but I know I like the potatoes because that's one of my favorite foods and green beans are always delicious. I put some salt and pepper on it. You could do some garlic seasoning on it or everything but the bagel seasoning, which I love and I have used in many different videos on this channel. But thank you for watching and don't forget to click that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that way you know when new recipes are coming out. And comment below what you're having for dinner tonight because it might be featured on a future video. I'll see you next time.